going on YouTube? Uh, got a mail day here. Um, I've had a few packages come in over the last couple of days. I've actually got five more coming in uh, here and within the next probably, I don't know, three or four days or so. But uh, So I was going to wait and make one big video of what's come in, but I got an unexpected package in the mail today from this guy right here, Sevens, Michael. Um, he didn't let me know I had anything coming, so this caught me off guard. Um, I have no clue what this is. I haven't opened it yet. Uh, I wanted to open it on camera. That way we can all be surprised together. Um, but I'll go ahead and save that for the end. I'll go ahead and show what's coming off of eBay the last couple of days. Um, I've been wanting to pick up uh, cards of former Iowa Hawkeye football players. And so I've managed to do that. And uh, wanted to pick up guys' autographs that I liked when I first started watching football. Um, maybe not the Hall of Famers. Um, I think, I feel like a couple of them will be, but um, just guys that I enjoyed watching play. So, uh, up first, uh, this guy played University of Iowa. Then he played for the Washington Redskins and Minnesota Vikings. Um, but I didn't want a card with him in either one of those uniforms. Being a Packers fan, neither one of those two teams excite me very much. So I was able to pick this up. It's from 2011 Press Pass Legends. And this is the Saturday Signatures of Paul Krause. Uh, beautiful on-card autograph. Big, bold, blue signature. Inscribed Hall of Fame 98. Um, really, I, I, I just can't understand how these cards go so cheap. I managed to pick this one up for $8. Um, just great looking card to add to my collection. Um, up next, this guy. Man, if he could only stay healthy. It, it, the things that he can do on a football field were just incredible. Um, this is from 2007 NFL SP Authentic. The By the Letter set. A former Iowa Hawkeye great and Indianapolis Colt great. Bob Sanders. Safety, this guy. This is numbered 36 out of 70. This guy was such a pleasure to watch. And this penny sleeve, I have this thing and it looks, makes the card look terrible. But there you go. There's what it looks like. Beautiful silver ink autograph. Big bold. No fading or bleeding or anything. Just a great looking card. I loved watching this guy play. Former defensive player of the year. Man, like I said, if he could have only stayed healthy, the things that he could have done. Um, love that card. And on to guys that I just enjoyed watching play. This is also from 2011 uh, Press Fest Legends. This is also Saturday Signatures. And this is Easy Ed McCaffrey with the great autograph. Got the football with the laces in there with his number 87. This guy, man, he was awesome. But the fact that he wore the smallest and least amount of pads that he possibly could, and he also wore shoes that were too small for his feet. So small, in fact, that he actually had to cut the back of them in order for his foot to actually fit into them, because he felt that the smaller the shoe and the tighter they were, the faster he was. And he was just an incredibly tough football player. Um, wish he would have been a Packer instead of a Bronco, but what can you do? Um, this is from his Stanford, uh, in his Stanford uniform. Um, just really like that card. I love these press pass cards. On card autographs are the best. I, I love them. Uh, next, this guy was so, this guy was just really cool to watch. Big, huge, barreling, tough guy. Uh, another Big Ten team, uh, played at Purdue. Not a favorite of mine, being a Hawkeye fan, but Loved watching this guy play. And this is from 1998 SP Authentic um, Players, Inc. of Mike Allstott. That huge on-card autograph with number 40 inscription. Uh, love the picture. Him in Bucks helmet and Pro Bowl jersey. 
Um, this is the silver version, numbered out of 100, numbered 100 of 100. Um, when I saw this card, I just had to pick it up. Just loved the look of it. So, there's that one. And last of the pickups that I have to show you before I bust into Michael's package is from 2001 Playoff. Uh, this is a buyback autograph from the Unsung Heroes uh, insert set. And this is uh, one of my favorite safeties to ever play the game. Just This guy is tough, tough, tough. Uh, played for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers and Denver Broncos. I searched a long time wanting to find an autograph of him in a Bucks uniform, which is not easy to find. And I came across this one. The seller had an enormous buy it now price on it. And But he had a best offer option. I went back and forth with him a while and was able to get him down to price that I was thought was fair, so I guess I should go ahead and show it since I keep talking about it, but here it is from 2001 Playoff Unsung Heroes Buyback Autograph of John Lynch. Big, huge signature on there. I love the card's really nice on its own. It's got a nice hollow foil to it, but you can see that number right down there. It's a buyback autograph number 2 of 35. Just a beautiful card of an awesome, awesome player. And the back there, uh, this card was originally uh, serial numbered and then playoff put uh, uh, some foil over it that says playoff honor roll. I'm guessing that was the product. I don't know. I didn't buy uh, football cards back then, so I didn't know. I don't know if playoff honor roll was actually one of their products or what, but that's or if that's what they're calling their buybacks. But anyway. Gorgeous card. Guy wanted eighty-five dollars. It was eighty-five or eighty-nine. Buy it now or best offer. And I was able to talk him down to thirty dollars. So pretty, pretty happy to have that in my collection. Beautiful card. Like I said, wanted in a Bucks uniform. I was able to find one. So there that is. Um, really happy to get all those cards. I, like I said, wanted to pick up Iowa guys and then just guys that or legends in my mind. Guys, I just really loved watching. So, now, on to Michael. And I'm a little scared. Like I said, he didn't let me know anything was coming, so whatever it is, I will be very happy. Thank you in advance, Michael. He didn't need to send me anything. Uh, sending me the Packers cards from the group break was more than enough. So, let me go ahead and check this out. Looks like there's a couple things in there. We got a note. It says, Michael, just a little something better than the last package I sent you. Enjoy, my friend. With the Michael Wilkie 7 autograph. Like I said, <laughs> I, I loved what you sent me before, man. Those beautiful old school cards. Loved them. So, whatever we got here, just bonus. Um, I don't know there's a certain order, so I'm just going to go ahead and slow roll off the note and see what we got here. Oh, this is... Oh, Lord. I know that number right there, and I'm thinking this is from UD Premier, and that's Greg Jennings. And I know these are the sets that you're putting together, so this scares me a little bit. Boom. Two-color patch. Plaxico Burst, one color. And Dion Branch looks like three color. Look at that. Number six out of 25, the gold version. Sick patch card. That thing is awesome. Thank you, Michael. Um, one more. <laughs> I'm a little nervous to look. Oh. What do we got here? Oh, no way. Mirror Gold. Ryan Grant from... Uh, 2010 certified. Memory serves me right. These uh, golds are numbered out of 25. Yes, 15 out of 25. Look at that. Awesome, awesome card. So, yeah, look at that. Awesome package for Michael. I really appreciate it. Thank you very much. Um, I will be hitting you back. 
I'm gonna have to find you something. Uh, thanks, uh, yeah. Thanks everybody for, uh, watching my video and, yeah, uh, nothing else to say. <laughs> thanks a lot, guys. Uh, bye.